what is going on guys so today i'm going to tell you the four best smartphones for PUBG. okay it's these four right here however i'm also going to tell you which one is number one out of these four so the first thing i want to mention is if you guys are using a smaller phone for PUBG mobile then you go to any one that's a little bit bigger your game's going to already improve all right, so we have the Google Pixel 3 XL, Huawei Mate 20 Pro, Samsung Galaxy Note 9, and iPhone XS Max. I have played with many, many phones on with PUBG Mobile, and I tell you, hands down, these are the four best phones, and not only do I say this, but my wife says this as well, and she's probably 5% one of the best players of PUBG Mobile on the North American servers. Now let me turn all these over. Okay, so when I'm talking about playing PUBG Mobile on these phones, I'm talking about playing bare bones, okay? You basically get the phone naked like this, and you start playing. I'm not talking about using, like, these triggers that you can pop on the phone, or you can even get, like, these remotes and stuff like that. The only thing about these things, like, for instance, this one here, you know, you have, you have like, a trigger here. The thing is, this block's, like, a big part, so you may have enemies that you're not going to see. Even when you use these triggers... I mean, these triggers are pretty cool because you're able to, like, run, jump, aim, and shoot the same time when you have the, uh, the triggers. But again, they do block some of the screen, and a lot of times I was sniped right in the head because I couldn't see somebody that was kneeling next to a tree a mile away when I probably would have saw him if I didn't have this clip on here. So I used these for a while, and then basically I just gave up on these. Same with my wife. She actually threw these at me. Let me go ahead and flip these back to the rear here. Now, before I tell you which one is number one out of these four, there are pros and cons of some of these. For instance, if we talk about graphics, I'll tell you the Huawei, the, the Samsung, and the Google, they're better on their eyes. It looks crisper. I mean, the graphics look awesome. The iPhone XS Max looks awesome too, but it doesn't look as good as these Android phones. Another thing is about battery life. Now, I played on these phones numerous times, and I can tell you, these three right here, Android phones, seem about the same, but I do notice that the iPhone XS Max does lose battery percentage a little bit faster. Now, let's talk about speakers, okay? Usually, I play with headphones or uh, earphones on, but if I'm playing bare naked like this with nothing, I'll tell you right now, the best of the speakers is going to be the Google Pixel 3 XL. And the reason is, is because, you know, for instance, if I'm playing with the iPhone XS Max here, the speakers are down here. Every time I'm, I'm playing and, you know, I started getting a lot of heavy firing and stuff like that, I start pressing my phone kind of hard like this, all of a sudden the volume just drops like dramatically. So that's like an issue. Even like, you know, for instance, here's a Samsung uh, Galaxy Note 9. You have the speakers right here as well. You start pushing in, you can't hear nothing. You can barely hear anything. However, with the Google Pixel 3 XL, the speakers are on the front here. So every time, it doesn't matter what you do here, no problem, you're going to hear everything. So speaker-wise, I will go with the Google Pixel 3 XL. Now let's talk about the feel of it. You know, when you're sitting there playing the game, you know, each of these phones, the glass feels a little bit different, you know, the smoothness and stuff like that. I'll tell you, out of all these, these four phones right here, the most that I'm more comfortable with, the one that just seems smoother, even if your hands are cold or a little bit sweaty, the iPhone XS Max, I do feel most comfortable with, okay? So out of these phones, which one do you think I'm going to pick is the number one best gaming PUBG mobile smartphone out there. And I'm going to choose the iPhone XS Max. Why? Because there's a huge reason there's a secret weapon on the iPhone XS Max. And what does the iPhone XS Max have that these don't, phones don't have? They have the 3D touch. Let me go ahead and explain. Hey, let me just show you guys really fast. I have the brightness up to the max on all of these. And that's how you, you know, I mean, that's how I play. A lot of professional players, they basically put the... Um, the brightness all the way up to the max every time they play, okay? So, there you go. I mean, they all look pretty good, but like I said, the, uh, the Android phones look better on the eyes, especially when you're playing than the iPhone XS Max. I'll go ahead and a little bit closer for you. You can go ahead and... All right, so let me go and explain to you about the 3D Touch, the secret weapon on the uh, iPhone XS Max and how it works, okay? Let me just start off on one of these Android phones here. and Let, let me go ahead and log in really fast. 
I'll go ahead and just play it on the um, Huawei Mate 20 Pro here. Hey, really fast about the speakers. Uh, like I said, the uh, Samsung Galaxy uh, Note 9 and the, um, the iPhone, once you cover the sides of it, because the speakers are back here, you can barely, it's, I mean, the volume drops dramatically. The Huawei, the volume doesn't drop as much, but it still drops. Watch, ready? You, you can hear that, right? Jeez, finally, okay, I got an uh, AKM here, okay. So, let's do something for example here, okay. Okay, so every time you guys shoot, right, I mean, here's the trigger right here, right? So, if you're running around and you see an enemy, you have to, you see how that is? Okay, let me show you again. So, you can't like, you, you can't sit there and swing left and right when you're shooting. I mean, you would need like three fingers to do that. Now, let me get on the iPhone XS Max and let's enable the 3D touch and let me show you exactly what I'm talking about. Now, the only thing I got to mention is, um, you know, I say that this is the number one phone, in my opinion, out of every other phone in the market for PUBG Mobile, the iPhone XS Max is, but also it is the most expensive. It is definitely much, much more expensive than even these flagship phones as well. Let me give you a quick example about the speakers I was talking about, the ones that have it like on the side here. So you, you can hear it right now, right? Now look how much lower the volume is. So it makes a big difference. Now the thing is, I have the 3D touch now. Okay, it's enabled. Let me show you how that, let me show you how to enable that first. You go into your settings here, and then we're gonna go under controls. And right here in the middle, you see where it says enable 3D touch? These other Android phones don't have this option right here. This little thing right here, enable 3D touch. And now with this 3D touch, let me just go back into the game. Now, if I press it on the screen, check that out. So now I can run, I can run, and I can aim the same time. Let me give you like another example in case you guys aren't really following what I'm talking about. So rather than me having to go like this and push the uh, the trigger button, you know, I mean, I'm not able to move, I'm not able to move it like this. Oh, there's a mini right here. Hold on, hold on, I gotta get him real quick. Here he is, here he is, look, look, there he is. Sucker! You like that? You see how I was able to run? Here, let me grab another gun from this guy. Okay, we'll just get this one right here. All right? So example, let's say the guy is right here in front of me. I just press this and I can. So I hope you guys kind of understand where I'm going with the 3D touch. You're going to up your PUBG mobile game instantly. Oh, another guy. I'll be back, guys. Anyways, there you guys go. Again, I think the number one smartphone for PUBG Mobile in the world right now is the iPhone XS Max. And I have a message for my wife here. If she watches this video, like I said, she is probably top 5% of PUBG Mobile players in the North American servers. I have a message for her because she doesn't let me join her team or let me play with her. If you're watching this video, Janet, you better get ready because my team is in training. And soon, you're going to be at the end game with another team. And you're going to find out it's with my team. And you better be very, very careful 
because you're getting ready to get sniped right in the back of the head. And then you're going to be crawling around looking for a revive. Well, guess what? Your teammates are already down. Look up slowly now, and this is what's going to happen.